Hey, what's going on there, YouTube? This is SEL0320 representing JVS. I'm back here again for a brand new TV show review, first reaction, non spoiler reaction to The Vampire Diaries. This is episode 13. Uh, this one is work. And no, I'm not talking about the Maxwell song, even though know, that's an awesome song. Uh, <laughs> But no, uh, what did I think about this episode? I actually liked it. I actually thought it was really compelling, really good. Um, the last episode kind of felt really lackluster in a lot of different ways. Uh, but this one, it had a lot of different dimensions because it showed like the back history of the heretics, Julian. Um, even like given the situation that happened, you know, like Damon coming off and telling Steph and what he told him about him killing Elena. Um... Caroline putting her life in jeopardy just from having these, you know, these babies sucking the life out of her. Um, it's, it's a lot that was coming into it, you know. That's why I was more excited last episode about what was going to be in this one. And they actually delivered really well. I think that everybody's performance was pretty good, really compelling. But definitely the one that stole the show was this, this, this amazing <laughs> vampire hunter by the name of Rhea Cruz. And you get to actually see her backstory. And you actually get to see... Where's her origin story? I think that it would have been better if they would have kind of strung it along for maybe like two episodes progressively instead of like showing like an old version and then just this whole episode kind of like surrounded. But they did a good job of what they had. Uh, even seeing like her backstory and like how she became like this epic killing machine, there was a lot of sacrifice that was put in play just for her to be at this state. Uh, not just that, like her devotion to what she's doing is, is understandable uh, in a lot of different regards. And I thought that was actually one of the more... Uh, stronger moments of this episode, but even with Damon, like Damon <laughs> puts his family, you know, the ones that he loves that are left in jeopardy, put their lives in jeopardy to try to make a mess for what he did, and it's like by the end of the third third act, I was like, oh my gosh, like there, there's a lot of different things that piece together pretty well to show you how things are gonna be uh, in three years ahead of time. And the end, to be quite honest with you, I can't wait to talk about that in the spoiler review. Um, I can't wait to see where that's going to go um, in a lot of different regards. So, um, what was something else I could talk about? Hmm. Oh, yeah. Bonnie and Damon. <laughs> they finally had a moment. They finally were bonding. They finally were like, you know, either clashing or butting heads or just there for each other. Like, she was there for him. You know what I'm saying? And I... I love that part about this episode. I was like, they're not hiding it anymore. Like, they're just, you know, letting them be. Even if they're not together, even if they're just friends, like, I love their chemistry together. I love the the anxiety and the feel of what they mean to each other. And it, 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 a lot of different ways, like, Bonnie, she kind of seems like she's really taken with uh, Damon. Like, even when there was a certain dialogue that, based on, you know, last episode when he kind of had this fling with this girl, that gets, you know, kind of sprung up on Bonnie and her reaction is pretty funny. But then there's some things that happens um, that Damon has to really be there for her just as much as he had to be there for his brother. And there's it's a lot of things that happen that I really liked about this episode. So I actually give this episode like an 8.5 out of 10. I thought it was a definite thumbs up. Um, hope you all enjoyed my first reaction, non spoiler review for it. Stay tuned. I'll be right back for a spoiler review of this episode. This almost worked. Peace, y'all. Why not point down? <laughs>